Following the successful deployment of armored multipurpose vehicles, AMPVs, to operational units earlier this year, the Next Generation Combat Vehicles Cross-Functional Team, NGCVCFT, is persisting with its vigorous pace to design and commission the future U.S. Army vehicles projected to be operational in 2030, 2040, and the subsequent years. The Armored Multipurpose Vehicle, AMPV, is a program initiated by the U.S. Army to replace the M113 armored personnel carrier and other older vehicles in its fleet. The program was initiated because the M113S were becoming outdated and unable to keep up with the Abrams tanks and Bradley infantry fighting vehicles on the battlefield. Earlier in March, the 1st Armored Brigade Combat Team, 3rd Infantry Division, set a milestone by being the first unit to be equipped with the AMPV. The project was one of the inaugural initiatives undertaken by the NGCV CFT soon after its formation in 2018. As the AMPV is now being actively used by soldiers in combat, the role of principal proponent for the vehicle has been assumed by the Army's Maneuver Capabilities Development and Integration Directorate MCDID. The development of the AMPV was initiated in 2012, but it gained considerable momentum after the establishment of the Army Futures Command AFC and its CFTs in 2018. By 2019, the NGCV CFT was assigned the responsibility for the AMPV's requirements, integration, and fielding, in addition to overseeing the initial low-rate vehicle production, testing, and evaluation. The Army formally accepted the first AMPV in June 2019, which led to an intensive phase of soldier-level testing and evaluation. As of April 28, 2023, with the successful delivery of the AMPV to the first equipped unit, Gen James E. Rainey, the commanding general of AFC, has officially transferred the responsibility for the AMPV from the NGCV CFT to MCDID. The AMPV is intended to fill a variety of roles on the battlefield such as a general purpose vehicle, mission command vehicle, mortar carrier, medical evacuation vehicle, and medical treatment vehicle. The design of the AMPV emphasizes survivability, mobility, and versatility. The AMPV program went through a competitive bidding process. BAE Systems, the manufacturer of the Bradley Fighting Vehicle, was awarded the contract for the AMPV in December 2014. The first AMPVs were expected to be delivered in 2020. The Armored Multipurpose Vehicle AMPV, developed by the U.S. Army is a tracked vehicle. It's designed this way in order to be able to maneuver in various types of terrain, and to keep pace with other tracked vehicles in the Army's arsenal, such as the Abrams main battle tank and the Bradley Infantry Fighting Vehicle. The track design offers enhanced off-road mobility compared to wheeled vehicles, especially in rough terrain, muddy or snowy conditions. The Armored Multipurpose Vehicle AMPV, program includes the development of vehicles in five different mission role variants. The General Purpose GP, variant is intended for multipurpose tasks and could be utilized for transporting troops or carrying supplies, depending on the needs of the mission. The Mission Command MC, variant is designed to support battlefield command and control. It features advanced communication systems that enable commanders to effectively coordinate their forces. The Mortar Carrier MC, variant is designed to carry and support a 120mm mortar system. It provides a mobile, protected platform for indirect fire support to the troops on the ground. The Medical Evacuation MEV, variant is a vehicle specifically designed for the medical evacuation of wounded soldiers from the field. It offers protection to both the medics and the wounded soldiers during evacuation. Lastly, the Medical Treatment MTV, variant is like a mobile medical treatment facility equipped with everything needed to provide immediate medical treatment to wounded soldiers in the field. This means that life-saving treatment can be provided much closer to the frontline, reducing the time between injury and treatment.